Now, this morning, there are concerns about a record outbreak of Lyme disease hitting Florida this summer. ABC Action News reporter Sean Daly says warmer temperatures plus Tampa Bay's growing population have doctors here and nationwide on high alert. Guys, Tampa Bay is a potential target for a Lyme disease outbreak because of all our suburban sprawl, like here in Pasco County. Thick woods meeting new houses. Jayane Gotchal lives in Wesley Chapel. She has two young daughters and 20 deer that roam her backyard. The deer come every day. They get close to me because they used to it for me now. That's dangerous, especially since Jayani's never heard of Lyme disease. Warmer temps on the East Coast plus suburban sprawl have doctors predicting an epidemic. About 400,000 cases of Lyme disease this summer, with a possible 30% of cases in Florida. Infected ticks riding on birds, deer, mice, and your pets carry the debilitating disease. If an infected tick bites you, you'll see this, a bullseye rash. You'll have aches, pains, flu symptoms. If you did not see the rash and did not go to the doctor right away, it's very difficult to make a diagnosis of Lyme disease. In later stages, Lyme disease masks itself as depression, anxiety. They have fatigue, they have memory problem, they have difficulty focusing and concentration. I want to for sure research and you know have some knowledge about and see what I can do like precautions. In Wesley Chapel, Sean Daly, ABC Action News. All right, thank you, Sean. If you live near a wooded or grassy area, check for ticks daily. Also, most insect repellents work against ticks as well. We have other steps you can take to prevent Lyme disease on our website, abcactionnews.com.